Good evening, and welcome back to Let's Play Metal Gear Solid. When we left off last time, we made it to Metal Gear, and we were getting all set. We found out from Otacon that the one pal key we have is going to be enough, actually, to completely take out this thing, to, to enter the override code. We're going to have to do some kind of tricks with temperature to get it to change shape, but it'll work out, except then uh, Revolver Ocelot shot the key out of our hand and it landed in the water. But I've got it now, so let's climb on up here. Now, I didn't climb up off screen, even though I probably could have, because I don't know if there's going to be any like cutscenes or anything on the way, and I didn't want to take a chance in this and that, so. Apologies if this is a bit tedious, but I figured better safe than sorry. That's not the way. I have to remember how to get over to the control room, which I'm pretty sure is shut down anyhow, so what am I even going to do once I get in there? Over there, but we'll see if we can't figure it out. I kind of- there was a Revolver Ocelot and Liquid Snake there, and I would really rather not take on both of them at once. Up the ladder, we can do it. There we go. really much we can do up here. We just gotta go on the other side. Alright. Oh, get out of here. I'm in no mood for your nonsense, guys. Oh, no, oh, that's. Uh, I just wanted to get a little distance before I threw it, but that was very silly of me. Up the stairs. Try that again. There. Okay, so one of these is the room temperature one. That shouldn't be a problem. Oh, dang it, I just hit... Okay, we're good, we're good. No, don't, don't! Looks like the key doesn't fit. No, we have to get it cold. I wasn't trying to access that, I was trying to walk past it. Not really. Waste all my chaff grenades. Well, probably not. I think that's one of three. It should be okay. Ooh, ration. That was really good to find. Alright. I can use that. And we need the key, but first I'm thinking armor just in case. Switch up weapons. Okay, so how are we gonna freeze this thing? Is 
something in this room or do I have to backtrack like all the way outside in the snow? Guys, I don't want to fight you. I'm trying to figure out how to freeze a key. What was that noise? It's just a box, don't worry about it. Just a box. Get out of the way! Oh, you you already said it was just a box. Why you gotta <laughs> Oh my box is lost now, isn't it? That's a bummer. Can't walk past this. Or... See, there's something kind of there's there's like camera kind of here-ish. It looks like, and then there's like this red dot inside, but I'm not sure what that's all about. Huh. Okay. I think I'm gonna find what I need in here, am I? No. There's not gonna be a way to freeze it in there. Alright. Let's try this again. I think there's potential for the box to work out. Oh, I do still have my box, good. I think I just have to be at the right place. If I'm in kind of a sort of obvious walkway, then it seems like they're more likely to end up running into me a couple times and getting suspicious. I think I'm fine here because they have a way around me. Mr. Box. Continue on your way. Here we go. See, he's got a path to just walk away, no problem. I think. It's just a. Get out of the oh way. God. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. Get down. Some of us are trying to figure out how to freeze a card. We don't really care about all of you guys. Not the box of this. It may become necessary. I'm just gonna run away a lot. Oh, you know what? Before I get too committed in backtracking so far, let's call everybody and see if they have ideas. You've got to lower that card key's temperature. Find some place cold. Yeah, I was gonna go outside. Okay, so it sounds like maybe that is on the right track, but just in case, Master. Now freeze that key. Get somewhere cold. All right. Nastasha. There is a big difference between conventional weapons and weapons of mass destruction. Conventional weapons are intended for use against military targets, but nuclear weapons are used against non-combatants. Nukes are designed to kill tens of thousands of innocent civilians in a flash. That is why nuclear weapons are so evil. Other point? Arakan. Next, you've got to cool the card key. Yeah. Where should I do that? This is Alaska. <laughs> Go outside. It's cold everywhere. But you're close to the warehouse where you fought Raven, right? Yeah. That place is right in the middle of the permafrost layer, and there's no heater either. That key is actually an IC card. Its connector pins and main body are made of a shape memory alloy. It's designed so that unless it's been changed to the correct shape, it won't be recognized by the PAL code. Okay, yeah, you told me this part before. Alright, outside it is. But we did get the first code entered successfully, so. What can Milling? I do for you, Snake? You could say it for me, Milling. Um, wherever. I know I should be paying more attention to where I say it, but. Yeah. Alright. 
Nick, Leo de Rocher said, win any way you can. Nice guys finish last. What about you, Snake? Is that what you think? Is there anything that you wouldn't do to stay alive? You should think about that, Snake. That's kind of a strange question to ask me at this point, Mei Ling, but that's okay. Alright, where's my next steroid right here? Oh, and you know what's kind of obnoxious? So we're gonna go outside, we're gonna change it to cold, then we're gonna have to go all the way back up, input it cold, and then climb all the way back down and figure out how to get it hot. Oh, to find the key, it was just hanging out in the water. Um, and I did eventually figure out and thank you for, uh, someone gave me a tip on the last uh, episode in the comments that I need to throw the bomb away instead of just keep it in my inventory and let it explode on me. That's why I suddenly died. So that was taken care of. Where's the door here? Okay, this was not the way to go. down in the water, was it? Mm, here we go. Alright. Keep. <laughs> oh my gosh! I forgot about that. Ooh! Not, not the box. That's not any help at all here. Um, I panicked and hit buttons. Armor. Grenade. Alright, let's go. where we had our battle. Oops, that was dumb. Alright, let's... So... Okay, I guess there's gotta be somewhere like specific. I I'm assuming it's gonna give me some kind of notice when it changes shape, so... Alright, what do you want me to do with this, Otacon? Next, you've got to cool the card key. You're close to the warehouse where you fought Raven, right? Yes, so what do I do there? It's in the middle of permafrost layer, there's no heater, okay. Well, I'm here. missing here. Come on, Key. Change shape. It's nice and cold. Oh, 
Maybe I just need to step out and it'll tell me that I did enough. Right, I guess we'll try that. So, key. Oh, yeah, it looks blue now. Okay, great, great. We're good to go then. Oh, uh, oh my god, until I do that. That was terrible. Snake, oh, I, and I know those are there. I hesitated because I was thinking, oh, I gotta get my chaff grenade out. Okay, let's make sure it's... I'm sure it's still... Okay, yeah, we're good. So. Let's go through this quick. Wonderful. All right. Journey back up to the top. gonna run past the guard when we get to that point because as soon as I go up the stairs it's like not zone anyhow so it's fine I don't want to take a lot of time creeping in my box and messing around with this guy and taking damage okay so down this way over here go for it yeah huh? it was just me Get down. There. I did take, take some damage I possibly could have avoided there. Maybe not the best plan. Eh, whatever. Alright. Excellent. Awaiting Palco number three. Okay, there goes Palco number two. All right, time to heat this bad Next boy comes up. Pal number three. Warm the key. So much better. All right, team. First, melee. We've made some progress. What is it, Snake? I'm gonna go ahead and say it again, because I do a fair amount of dying, so it seems like a good plan to have a lot of saves. In China, they say the snake, knowing itself, strikes swiftly. It means that if you have confidence that what you are doing is part of your true nature, there should be no hesitation. I don't know whether your orders are in your true nature or not, but Snake, believe in yourself. All right, Mei Ling, that one was pretty good. That I do quite appreciate. Arakan, you gave the most useful advice last time. Everyone else was just like, get it cold. Somewhere warm? What about the blast furnace? But the problem is, if you go through a cold place on the way back, the card key might change shape. You need to hurry on the way back. Aha. Uh -huh. All right. All right, let's attempt a bit of stealth here. Because ideally, I'd rather not take any more damage. I suppose the one good thing about backtracking, though, is that... Rations are respawning, so that's really useful. Oh, 
What was that noise? Huh? Alright, if he What's flips it, I'm just gonna throw him down and run. Huh? What was that noise? Just a box. Hmm. Alright. Huh? What was that noise? Time to go. Whatever, it works. Okay, so back to the blast furnace. And I'm trying to remember exactly where that is. Oh. Well, Whatever, just go back till I find it. It'll be fine. Uh, here? Here. Alright. I'm kind of nervous, though, because I'm feeling like... This is... I, I don't want to say too easy, because we are doing a lot of back and forth, but... It's kind of too easy in terms of where is Ocelot, where is Liquid Snake. They gotta show up at some point to ruin this for us, I'm sure. So am I going to be able to even get the last key in, or is it going to be like one of them shows up to ruin the day? That's right, that's just stairs. What? What? Oh, who's out here now? You guys weren't here before. Whatever. Not that they're really much of a problem. Okay, so I defeated Fulcrum Raven, defeated Sniper Wolf, defeated Psycho Mantis. Revolver Ocelot is not dead, so we'll probably have to rematch him again, I'm assuming. I'm gonna have to battle Liquid Snake again. Hopefully not in a helicopter this time. Was that everyone? I I want to say I think that, because there was Decoy Octopus, but Decoy Octopus is dead. So I think that's all the people that we need to be worried about. Snake, it's about Naomi Hunter. Then you should talk to the Colonel. He's looking into it. Turn your monitor off. All right. Okay, it's off. No one else can hear us. Go ahead. Sorry, but I didn't want the Colonel to hear. Why not? Okay, so what's up? I've got a good friend in the Pentagon. Yeah? He's the one who told me about it. It looks like the DIA recently developed a new type of assassination weapon. An assassination weapon? Snake, have you ever heard of something called Fox Die? I actually have. No. No, we just heard Fox him talking die. about it, Snake. Liquid and the others were talking about it. Yeah. Yeah. It's some kind of virus that, that targets specific people. I don't know all the details, but... What are you trying to say? It's too similar. To what? What is? The cause of death. Didn't the arms tech president and the DARPA chief, I mean, decoy octopus, die of something that looked like a heart attack? Yeah, unexpectedly, yeah. out of the blue. Well, apparently, fox die kills its victims by simulating a heart attack. Dun dun no. dun. You're telling me that Naomi was behind it? Snake, try to remember. Did Naomi give you some kind of injection? Probably. The nano machines. She was in the best position to have done it, but I don't know what her motive was. Does the Colonel know? I'm not sure. But he still hasn't questioned her. Well, that's awfully okay. suspect. I'll ask him myself. Colonel, 
What's new with the Naomi situation? I just placed Naomi under arrest. Arrest? She was sending coded messages towards the Alaskan base. I didn't want to believe it, but she must be working with the terrorists. Are you sure? I'm afraid so. She's being interrogated now. What kind of interrogation? Well, I'd like to avoid the rough stuff, but we don't even have any sodium pentothal here. Call me if you find out anything. So it's true, isn't it? Hmm. Naomi, I can't believe it. That means the Fox Dye vaccine must be around somewhere. Listen, I've got bigger things to worry about. But Snake, you might be infected too, you know. Yeah, what if we All just I up and die at a crucial moment? Leave it up to the Colonel. I mean, Snake's got a point. What are we gonna do about it? We gotta just press ahead, but... But I don't know, he says leave it up to the Colonel, but now I'm thinking the Colonel's been kind of dodgy right along too. If there's things he knows that he's not telling us, how much can we really trust him? Ugh, betrayal, it's the worst. Hey, who's shooting at me? Not that side. Actually, I will want that side, but first. Over to the body armor. Now, who's shooting? Oh, a camera. Okay, whatever. Just, just go. Just don't worry about it, Snake. Okay, wait. I just got myself so confused. This is where I came in, right? Yeah. So it is another elevator. That's fine. Stop! And then the Deep Throat situation as well. Are we going to hear more from him? Who's that fella? What's his agenda in all this? He hasn't contacted us in quite a while. supplies in here. part is the blast furnace. You caught Snake? Yeah, I want to get it saved just so I can see the name of the area. That I'm in. Okay, cool. This is it. Snake, come what come may. Time and the hour runs through the roughest day. I know, We're I know. almost out of time, Snake. Please hurry. You're the only one who can stop them from launching that nuke. I'm two-thirds of the way there. All right, key. Is that hot or is that room temperature? Oops. Oh, that was foolish of me. over here patiently kind of patiently maybe not that patiently that was bad <gasps> oh yeah I forgot about that <laughs> Thank you. 
Well, that'll heat the card up well. Maybe that's what we should do, go to the edge and just kind of dip it in. That's safe, playing with lava, right? Oh, that's right. This is this horrible trick area. Okay, there's... How do I... Do I really want to mess around with this? I don't. I really want that ration. Come on, just creep over there. I'm gonna end up crawling into lava. Ooh. Okay, awesome. Now, okay, red, that's what we needed. So that is definitely ready. Let's get a little further and then we'll get the safe with Ming Ling. Because I'm concerned about making it quickly through the cold part. That might not go so well. Elevator rides are much nicer when there's not hordes of people trying to kill me on them. I appreciate that. Getting to the cold area, so. Mailing? What's up, Snake? Oh, just another need for a save, please. Thank you. Snake, don't give up. Remember, Macbeth, Act 5, Scene 3. I'll fight till from my bones my flesh be hacked. Give me my armor. Everyone is counting on you, Snake. You've got to do it. I'll do it, Mailing. I won't let you down. Where are we at in terms of rations? One. Okay. Well, it's something, I suppose. Maybe the game will be really nice and it'll let me get this last key in and refill my health before I have to fight someone. Snake. Can you hear me? Yes. It's Naomi. I know Naomi. it. Naomi? What the hell? Campbell and the others are busy right now. I'm on a different codec. Naomi. Is what the colonel says true? You traitor. Yes. But not everything I said was a lie. Who are you? I don't know myself. I don't know my real name or even what my parents looked like. I bought all my identification. But my reason for getting into genetics was true. Because you want to know yourself, right? That's right. I want to know where I came from. My, my age, my race, anything. She doesn't even know her age? Naomi. I, I was found in Rhodesia sometime in the 80s. A dirty little orphan. Rhodesia? What's now known as Zimbabwe? Yes. Rhodesia was owned by England until 1965, and there were lots of Indian laborers around. That's probably where I got my skin color from, but I'm not even sure about that. Naomi, 
You're too worried about the past. That's a good point. Isn't it enough to understand who you are now? Understand who I am now? Why should I? No one else tries to understand me. Why should they try to understand you if you don't I try to understand yourself? I was alone so long. that one around. Until I met my big brother. And him. Your big brother? Yes. Frank Yeager. What? Oh. He was a young soldier. When he picked me up near the Zambezi River. I was half dead from starvation and he shared his rations with me. Yes. Frank Yeager. The man who you destroyed was my brother and my only family. Sorry. No. Grey Fox? We survived that hell together, Frank and I. He protected me. He's my one connection. The only connection I have to my past. And he brought you back to America? No. I was in Mozambique when he came. Who is he? You mean Big Boss? Yes. He brought us to this land of freedom. This America. And then he and my brother went back to Africa to continue the war. And that's when it happened. Side note, I really like this you music. You killed my benefactor and sent my brother home a cripple. I vowed revenge and joined Foxhound. I knew it was my best chance to meet you and I prayed for the day that I would. So, were your prayers answered? Yes. I waited two long years. To kill me? Is that all you cared about? Well, yes. She's got motivation. That's right. Two years. You were all I thought about for two long years. Like some kind of twisted obsession. Do you still hate me? Not exactly. I was partly wrong about you. What about Liquid and the others? <laughs> I'll have my revenge on them, too. What do you have against them? Naomi, you didn't kill that doctor, too, did you? The one that used Grey Fox for his genome experiments? Dr. Clark? No. That was my brother. Afterwards, I covered it up and helped him hide out. So that ninja... I mean, Grey Fox... He's come here to kill me? I don't think so. I think he just came here to fight you. I wasn't sure before, but now I think I understand. A final battle with you. That's all he lives for. I'm sure of it. Fox. No. Naomi, tell me something. About Fox Dye? Fox Dye is a type of retrovirus that targets and kills only specific people. First, it infects the macrophages in the victim's body. Fox dye contains smart enzymes created through protein engineering. They're programmed to respond to specific genetic patterns in the cells. Those enzymes recognize the target's DNA? Right. They respond by becoming active and using the macrophages they begin creating TNF Epsilon. Huh? It's a type of cytokine, a peptide which causes cells to die. Oh. The TNF Epsilon is carried along the bloodstream to the heart, where they attach to the TNF receptors in the heart cells. And then... they cause a heart attack? The heart cells suffer a shock and undergo an extreme apoptosis. Then... the victim dies. Apoptosis? You mean the heart cells commit suicide? Naomi... What? You must have programmed that thing to kill me too, right? Oh. Do I still have time? Naomi, I don't blame you for wanting me dead. I kinda don't I can't either. go yet. I still have a job to do. Yep. Listen, Snake. I'm not the one who made the decision to use Fox Dye. Huh? You weren't. Who was? No. You were injected with Fox Dye as a part of this operation. Campbell. I just wanted to let you know that. No, that's not the whole truth. Well, what is it? Huh? The real thing I wanted to tell you was... Snake, I... I... Hey, what are you doing? <gasps> ah! <gasps> Snake! <gasps> Naomi! Well, what was she gonna say? Snake, I can't allow Naomi to make any more unauthorized transmissions. What? 
Hmm. Naomi's been removed from this operation. What happened to Naomi? What did she mean when she said that Fox Dye was a part of this operation? Colonel, let me talk to her. I won't. She's under arrest. Colonel. Yeah, this you guy's backstabbing us too. Snake, there's no time for that. Right now, your job is to stop Metal Gear. Ah, he's right, but still okay, it goes. Snake? Well, that was a doozy. Okay, and um, we're running long here, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and actually. Oh, here's the cold part. I'm gonna wind the episode down. So please like and subscribe if you've enjoyed this. Come back next time. We're gonna try to run through the ice fields. I mean, he's right. We've still got to at this point. We've got to try to stop Metal Gear, because that's the most important thing. We have to save innocent civilians. But... Oh, Naomi. Everything she's... Come, I mean... I, I do sympathize with her. I can get... Her, her anger is very understandable, which actually, that was a really cool conversation with her. You know, I should have known better. I was a little afraid that she was going to end up being this kind of, like, toss-away, not important enemy. Like, oh, yeah, she's working with them, but it's just, like some other thing no instead she's got like this all this background with snake she's got this legitimate reason to hate him but then she's found with working with him that he's not a totally bad guy like there's some really interesting development with her character there i quite enjoy that um more and more suspicious about campbell but uh, uh he's right even though he double crossed us and we're upset about that We've got to stop Metal Gear first before we can address anything else, although we've got to hope that we don't die. I'm wondering if what she was about to tell us was to direct us to the vaccine that Otacon mentioned. Because she, you know, when we asked her, so I'm infected too, doesn't answer. That's a yes. Do I have enough time to complete the mission? Doesn't answer. Yeah, it sounded like, a, like mm, we're going to go down any time. So I'm wondering if she realized that the mission was more important than her personal vengeance and she was going to get us to the vaccine. But... Now, maybe Otacon can help with that. Maybe we'll have to see how it all goes. We'll, we'll look into it next time.